When the clock struck six, it meant one thing for Ron Burgundy and his news team. Go time. Monomoy in the morning with Jake Burney on announcements. Courtney Kelly with sports. Susanna Brown, weather. Mitchell Silva on switcher. Hal Richmond on audio and teleprompter. Caroline Di Giovanni as program director. It's Monomoy in the morning. Good morning, Monomoy. Today is Wednesday, March 16th, and it's a day six in our schedule. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for a new segment for today. A refurbished school bus painted in bright designs by local artist Jackie Reeves can often be spotted parked near the entrance to Katuit Center for the Arts. The bus is targeted as a way to bring arts directly to schools rather than taking children on field trips to add hands-on creative experiences. The concept of the traveling classroom that is central to Steger's new position was hatched at a time when new ideas were sparking about how art organizations could share their resources and programs with young people during a time of COVID-19 concerns, when gathering inside in groups was often problematic. Center officials are now working to develop partnerships with local groups that offer more outdoor nature programs. That's all for news today. Now off to Jake with the announcements. Thanks, Courtney. And now for some announcements. Starting today, Harwich Youth Counselor Sheila House will be available every Wednesday for drop-in Jossum group sessions in the guidance office. Students can talk about stress management, anxiety, and other pertinent topics for today's teens. To sign up, students should find the MyFlex offering, Shark Cafe, Getting to Calmness. Attention all juniors. The class of 2023 is hosting a snap raise, and they need as many juniors as possible to register. This will help out for the, to their senior trip and the prom. To sign up, you can follow the link on the class of 2023's Google Classroom page and register 20 emails. Please contact Ms. Manning, Ms. Jones, or your class officers with any questions. Sophomores, you will see health screenings in your MyFlex Learning account for either March 21st or March 22nd. You will be meeting our nursing staff in the auditorium to complete your required hearing and vision tests. Please report to the auditorium during your scheduled time. The Monomoy High Theatre Company invites you to the 25th Annual Putnam County Spelling Bee. Six spellers enter, one speller leaves. At least the loser gets a juice box. Winner of the Tony and the Drama Desk Awards for Best Book, the 25th Annual Putnam County Spelling Bee has charmed audiences across the country with its effortless humor and wit. Tickets are $10 general admission, $5 for students. Shows are Wednesday through Saturday at 7 p.m. and there's also a Saturday matinee at 2. Come for laughs, come for the music, and come, come and support our incredibly talented students. Now to Susanna with the weather. Thanks Jake, and now for the weather. Today is going to be partly cloudy with a high of 47 and a low of 38. There's going to be some southwest winds at about 10 to 15 miles per hour and a 2% chance of pre precipitation. Now for the extended forecast. The first two few days this week are going to be rainy with some average temps in the high 40s. Let's head into our extended forecast. Heading into the weekend, it's going to be some heavy rain on Saturday with a high of 51 and a low of 41. Sunday is going to bring some more showers with a high of 47 and a low of 38. Lastly, on Monday, it's going to be sunny with a high of 49 and a low of 39. That's all for weather. Have a great day, Monomoy.